A Savannah family grieving the loss of a teenager uh, lost to gun violence. New today on WTOC, a woman is pleading for answers. More than a year after a 15 year old daughter was killed. Desiree Gilliard was found shot in Yamacraw Village last May. She later died at the hospital. Our Flynn Snyder sat down exclusively with her mother, who is still fighting to keep her daughter's memory going. Detrea Gilliard keeps pictures of her daughter Desiree throughout her home. Their house she stays connected to Desiree during what has been a painstaking and depressing year. May 6, 2022, the night my daughter departed this earth, is when my life stopped. In May last year, 15-year-old Desiree was found shot in Yamacraw Village where she lived. Desiree later died at a hospital. People don't realize unless you have children or lost somebody near and dear to you how hard it is to go on. More than a year later, Gilliard hopes to find more answers into her daughter's death. It makes me really sad, really depressed. Who did this to her and who could leave her out here in such a state? Fearing for her life, Gilliard has since moved out of Yamacraw Village. In January, she sued Savannah's housing authority for the wrongful death of her daughter. The lawsuit claimed negligence, saying the authority failed to properly secure Yamacraw Village and keep out criminals. Just the state of the deterioration, dilapidated buildings, broken windows, it was just already an advanced state of neglect. So they pretty much let Yamacraw go by the wayside. Court documents show the suit was dismissed in March, but with the door open for it to be filed again. This past December, Savannah police announced a $15,000 reward for information leading to an arrest. We checked back with SPD who have not announced any arrests in the case. Gilliard says she feels let down by the lack of answers. She hopes her daughter's story is a cautionary one that pushes others to do more in addressing gun violence and bullying. Two factors she says led to Desiree's death. Well, she was a young lady who had things really going for herself and she was going places. As she looks at Desiree's photos, Gilliard remembers her fashion-loving daughter as an aspiring doctor whose life was taken too soon. In Savannah, Flint Snyder, WTOC News. Gilliard says she's opened a new online store in her daughter's memory. Both she and Savannah police are asking anyone with any information about Desiree's death to please call police. You can do so anonymously.